very Jack and Daxter vibe. I mean, Crash Bandicoot vibes. That intro. Glorious, glorious HD. I'll just have to talk louder. I've actually got my mic pretty much maxed out. Or turn the game audio down a little bit. <laughs> the memory card. I love that they leave all that stuff in there. Even when they remaster it, like you still get the memory card screen. I have spent my life searching for the answers that my father and my father's fathers failed to find. Who were the precursors? Why did they create the vast monoliths that litter our planet? How did they harness Eco, the life energy of the world? What was their purpose? And why did they vanish? I have asked the plants, but they do not remember. The plants have asked the rocks, but the rocks do not recall. <laughs> Even the rocks do not recall. Every bone in my body tells me that the answers rest on the shoulders of a young boy. Oblivious to his destiny, uninterested in the search for truth, and rejecting of my guidance. And why would he want to listen I'm just playing to the game. same as the sage anyway? Thank you for stopping by, by I'm the way. the master of Green Eco, one of the wisest men on the planet. No particular reason. So it seems the answer begins not with careful research or sensible thinking. Nay, as with many of fate's mysteries, it I haven't played this game in so with long. A small act of disobedience. Hey, uh, Jack, old green stuff told us not to come here. The very clean remaster. It looks great. Super sharp. Hey, no problem. I don't know if you want me to say your name. I'm always hesitant whenever I know people off of Twitch to say what their name actually is. Do you pronounce your Twitch name Demonesis? Is that how you say it? You know what to do. Deal harshly with anybody who strays from the village. We will attack oh, okay. it in due time. Well, this is Janet Garcia. She's awesome. And it was pronounced it was pronounced correctly. Well look at that. Alright. What are we doing here anyway, Jack? This place gives me the creeps. I can't remember is is Jack silent in the first game? Huh? Or in all of them? I can't even remember. Oh, wow, stupid precursor junk. Eek! What is that dark ooze? It sure don't look friendly. <gasps> The sage yaps on about the precursors that built this place all the time. Where did they go? Why did they build this crud? Now, I like precursor orbs and power cells as much as the next guy. But if you ask me, they must have been real losers. Wow! How did you do that? I think we're in trouble! That was such a gamble. How could he have known Man, that, stung. <laughs> that that would have worked? I told you we shouldn't have come here, and you listened. What? <laughs> okay, okay. I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> Talk about some serious developer whiplash over what here. What in green tarnation do you do want? I'm 10 hours <laughs> into The Last of Us 2. Don't tell me. Instead of now going back to wisdom, this. The two of you went mucking around in the it's only wild. place that I told you not to go. Misty Island. That's right. And then And Daxter, you finally took a much needed bath. But in a bathtub filled with dark eco. Look, old man. Are you going to keep yapping? Or are you going to help me out of this mess? 
I'm going to keep yapping. Because in my professional <laughs> opinion, the change is an improvement. And besides, Ooh, burn. I couldn't help you if I wanted to. What? Correct. There's only one person who has studied Dark Eco long enough to have a chance at returning you to your previous form. Carl Acheron, the sage. But he lives far to the north. Far, far to the north. Nobody has spoken to him in ages. I would teleport you there, but I can't do that either. None of the three sages that maintain the other teleporter gates have seen fit to turn their ends on for quite a while. <laughs> the only other way north is by foot through the Fire Canyon, but its volcanic soil is hot enough to melt precursor metal. You can't just walk through it. But you could fly over it if you had a zoomer equipped with a heat shield. I just happen to be working on such a thing at this very How moment. Convenient. All I would need is 20 power cells to give it enough energy to withstand the canyon's heat. Isn't that right, Daddy? <laughs> yes, Kira, that might work. But where are a boy and a half going to get 20 power cells? From the villagers. Most of them have a power cell or two stashed away somewhere. And even if they aren't willing to just give them away, greasing their palms with a few precursor orbs should do the trick. And I bet there are even more of them out in the wilds just waiting for some brave adventurer to find. Well, we've got the brave adventurer at least. Brave adventurer? You two couldn't find your way out of the village without training. Before you do anything else, you better go through the warp gate and get some practice on Geyser Rock. Uh, we won't find any more of that dark gooey eco stuff, will we? Because I'd hate to fall in again and turn into you. <laughs> Get in there <laughs> before I turn you both into ferns. Oh, I should probably turn on subtitles. I didn't even think about that. Luckily, the dialogue in this game is very loud and clear. Which is nice. Okay. Probably under sound options. Or perhaps not. Graphic options. No. Game options. Oh, does it not have subtitles? Maybe they don't have subtitles. Saving to your memory card. What is going on? Oh, yeah. Triangle is the back button. Oh. This device is a communicator. With it, my father and I can give you advice That's at so any good. time during your quest. Oh no. Why is the camera rotation inverted? Is there can I change that at least? Oh no, that's not takes I'm getting used to. Alright. are precursor orbs. Collect enough of them and some of the villagers will give you a power cell in exchange. Are these orbs or are they eggs? Because they look like eggs. <coughs> Man, this art style just, it looks so good. I mean, obviously it's very, very crisp and shiny because of the remaster, but it just looks so good. It's so timeless. Man, look at the size of Jack's feet. Those toes are huge, man. Oh, yeah, I can roll. You know, to, to be perfectly honest, I don't know if I ever beat this game. This is a power cell, the most important precursor artifact you can find. You need to collect 20 of these so I can power the heat shield for your A-Grab Zoomer. All right.
You know a game series I really miss? Maximo. That was a great, 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 great game on PS2. I don't think I ever played the sequel. I don't know why. Let's <laughs> beat the game tonight. How how long is this game? If I had to guess, I would. Is it like in the ten hour ballpark? Sometimes you'll want to hit things with a greater force. To break one of these boxes, you should jump in the air and then dive down onto it, hands first. That's Blue Eco, which contains the energy of motion. Blue Eco allows you to run fast, break boxes, and even activate some precursor artifacts when you get near them. Oh, hell yeah. Let's go, Super Saiyan. Oh my god, you're so much faster. Ten hours according to how long to beat. Well, not happening tonight. But, that isn't very long. Probably knock it out in a few streams. I don't usually stream for longer than two or three hours. My current playthrough is Last of Us 2. Usually on Thursdays, I do like retro variety nights, so I'll just pick like a bunch of different games and play like 15 or 20 minutes of each. It's usually like Sega Genesis, Dreamcast. Um, NES, Super Nintendo. But tonight I decided to just That's focus a on a specific vent. game instead. More concentrated than the floating clusters. This vent will give you a full charge of blue eco, letting you use it for the maximum time. So maybe I'll I'll just focus on this game for the next few Thursdays. I'm liking it so far. It held up really well. I mean, obviously it's a remaster, so saying Good it's held work. up well is the a little disingenuous. Because I'm not Blue playing Eco, the original. You can breathe energy into all kinds of precursor artifacts that have been you... for years. Is there a way to make the camera recenter automatically? I don't think so. It kind of gives me like a. Donkey Kong 64 mixed with Crash Bandicoot vibe. It just looks so nice. Little subtle wind effects. Those little green balls of energy on the ground are a type of eco. Pick up 50 small green Ecos, or one big green one, to increase your health. Okay. You can jump once, then jump again in the air to reach even higher ledges. Honestly, one of the more enjoyable tutorial sections of this era. I'm a big fan of games that teach you in an environment and in situations that are Organic Can't come gameplay. Back to the gate until you find all four power cells on this island. Whoa, whoa, what, am I, what did I miss? Because I can't stand whenever a game just dumps tutorial notifications at you and just makes it super boring. Very sterile. I hate that. 
I'd much rather play through a, a little zone like this. Hey! You found one of my scout flies! I sent seven of them to each area to look for power cells, but the workers must have captured them all! There we go. Back to the beginning, because that's where I need to go. Oh, this is like a new little region over here. How did I miss all this before? There we go, I got all of the Orbeez. Completion time, yeah. Not, not even. I am not that kind of gamer. I cannot possibly care less. I'm here for a good time, not a complete time. That's how I live my life. Hey, what's up, Johnny? It is holding up incredibly well. <laughs> Thanks, Janet. Good training, boys. But that's nothing compared to the challenge. PS2 games just make me happy, you know. And then no problem. We got the moves, eh, Jack? Like how do you how do you play a game like this and not just feel warm and happy inside? Fine, fine. Yeah. Adventure away then. Just makes me feel good. And while you're out adventuring, why don't you make yourself useful? My darn green eco Yo. collectors are clogged up again. Head Thank up to you. The far side creates beach 88 the is mountain, now following. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate the that. They take you right there. Now, welcome, welcome. All of you. I try to play retro games every Get Thursday. Out of here. Ish. Don't always, but I try. All right, Janet, well, you know what? Just because you said that, I will endeavor to finish this game. I'll stream it every Thursday until I'm done. How about that? That is a verbal contract. I'm gonna play the whole trilogy. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. You know what? I never played two or three. I mean, okay. I say I never played them. I played them at friends' houses, you know, so I'm aware that two was like more Ratchet and Clank style with a lot more guns. And three had lots of different vehicles. So I'm like, I'm aware, but I, I never played the games. You know what I mean? So I'm kind of excited to dive into the trilogy and get to the to the other ones. Hey, baby! What do you say you and I go cruising on this A-Grab Zoomer? Rule number one, I don't date animals. Ah, uh, you don't know what you're missing. <laughs> it's your favorite game of all time? Listen, wow. If you need something to keep you busy, That's my cool. father always talked about an ancient precursor pipeline hidden deep underground. Some of these pipes end in vents yeah, I think from we which need to turn game audio freely, down a little bit. And some have been capped off so that the eco is sealed back. There must be a way to turn the capped vents on. I traced part of the pipeline back to the Forbidden Temple. Maybe you should look there for some type of switch. I, do, I know exactly what you mean. Uh, I know what you mean. I have franchises like that. I mean, that's how I am with the Zelda games. Like, if you ask me to tell you which Zelda game is the best, I would probably have to say Breath of the Wild or Link to the Past. But my favorite's Ocarina of Time, for sure. 
nostalgia plays such a big factor in that kind of stuff. But it's a it's a wonderful sign that you're an intelligent critic and an intelligent gamer that you can recognize flaws in your favorite things and still admit they're your favorite. So respect on that. I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing right now. I wasn't really paying attention, so I feel bad. Maybe we should go root out the fisherman. I heard he was in the jungle fishing by the lower river. Well, there we go. Thank you, Daxter. Appreciate it. The lower jungle down by the river. All right. Hey! It looks like scout flies are always in red boxes. Good observation. I would not have ever noticed that. So thank you. Daxter is uh pretty excellent here. Yo. Don't tell me that you me, 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 me. well. The, the first I hear of monster sightings near the village, and now this. See those gears up there, boy. See them? See how they're not moving? That means our village has it's no power. It's excellent, man. The it looks so good. The jungle temple has been interrupted. And boys, everyone's too far to go out and find out what's happened. Did you pay the bill? I have the collection yeah. on PS3. Oh, you're I'm funny. playing the digital version now, of the PS4 if you two fix the remaster on PS5. I'll give you a power but then I own a physical oh, copy and of and the PS3 thing. collection. If by any chance you're interested in I just didn't feel like hooking up my PS3. To my re-election campaign, I, I might be willing to part with yet another power cell. What's different? The minimum contribution is you say it's the oh, best version. Modest. 90 precursor orbs. Okay, 90 orbs. How many do I have? 50? Alright. Alright, man. I got you. I can. That can be arranged. Okay, he wants 90. Who else? Are there other people here I can talk to? Okay, no, I've been in here already. What's in here? Do we got somebody in this one? Yes, we do. Well, uh, hello there, my dear boy. You've caught me at a most inopportune moment. Uh, I was to set off on my journey yesterday. Oh, really, I John? I did not know that. Precursor orbs. It looks I so would have good. I my word that I had 90 of them. But I gather that your young friend, you know, the you know what? annoying, you might be right. ugly one, might have just pilfered them as a sort of a spot of fun. Because this isn't called HD Remaster anyway, or would anything. Would you be kind enough to loan your dear old uncle 90 precursor I think you're right. Orbs, so he can get underway, I would offer you a power cell in return. <laughs> Well, that makes this even more impressive because I thought this was a remaster. It looks so good. Yeah, the art direction holds up so well. I was actually talking earlier about... Did you ever play Maximo? Did you ever play those games? I, I really loved Maximo on PS2. But a lot of the games from this era... I feel like hold up really well. <laughs> you don't look so good yourself, lady. Oh, sorry. I thought you were a spotted orange bellied ring friend. You <laughs> know, yesterday I saw some terribly vicious creatures capture a mother flat flat near the beach. Now there's this poor little orphan egg sitting in a nest at the top of the cliff, and I can't get to it. If you could climb up there and push it off, I've piled some hay down at the base to catch it safely. Do an old lady a favor. I got and you. I'll give you a power cell. Man, so I need 20 power cells? That's gonna take forever. I've only got leads on like four so far. How many do I have? I've only got four. Muse. You're what? 
Haven't you ever seen a muse before? It's a little glowing squirrel about your size, full of spunk, and <laughs> crazy as a lark. Oh, I get it. Like a sidekick. <laughs> as a matter of fact, without my muse, I just can't sculpt. But with her around, I see beauty in everything, you know? They really right now, I couldn't chisel my way out of committed a to that pun, didn't they? I think she ran away to that misty island. Oh, I just hope she's all right. It's worth a power cell if you bring her back to me. Wait a minute. We are not going back to Misty Island. Are we? <laughs> yeah, Kingdom Hearts holds up really well, too. I love the animation. It just looks so good. <clears throat> no. Okay, let me go back. Hey. Thank you, Johnny, for the follow. Appreciate it. Gotcha, sucker. Yeah, it's all good, man. A lot of people that follow me on Twitter don't follow me on Twitch, obviously. You can just see the follower number discrepancy. But I just stream for fun at nighttime every now and then. I used to do it a lot more. I'm trying to get back to three times a week. Generally, probably going to be a Sunday, Tuesday, Thursday. Try to always do retro on Thursdays. You know, throwback Thursday and all that. Seems appropriate. Where's that dog? Oh. I kept hearing it barking, but I couldn't find it. They're trying to lead me into the water? No? Whoa! Where are you at? Come on. Nice. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it, man. All metal boxes are thicker than a yakal skull. But there must be something that can bust them open. I've almost got enough to go buy my first cell. Hey! That pelican just snagged a power cell! You bastard. Let's go kick some big bird butt! Thanks for hanging out, Johnny. Do you go by Johnny or Juan? Because I know on Twitter you're Juan. Oh, here's a power cell. There's that bird. Oh, 
We scrounged enough orbs to trade for a power cell. Let's get nice. back and make the switch already. No, I'm not in a hurry. We can wait a few, a little bit longer. Push the flood flood egg. All right, so I've got six power cells now. I would like to get that one that that other bird stole. Let's see if I can get over there to it. on the orbs. How do I get to that? Did I go this way? Yeah, I did. But I didn't go this way. Oh, it heals you. Weird, but all right. Oh, okay, I should have known it would give me something. Savage. He does not like Daxter. Ooh. Punch those poles up from below. <laughs> How do I punch up from below? I what it means. How do I punch up from below? Oh! You crouch punch. I didn't even know that was a thing. Okay. Am 
supposed to hit those now? No, I guess I'll go back up there. Maybe I can see something. Okay, so you gotta get the blue Seagulls. whatever. For kicks. I forgot what the blue stuff's called. Blue Echo or something. is pretty regularly there. Already up to eight. Not bad. Alright. Are there any other orbs around here? Aha! Here we go. Check back here. No. I don't think those seagulls like me very much right now. Okay, it looks like I can get up there now. They caused an avalanche. Wherever that Let's is. Check it out. Hundred thirty orbs, not bad. If I could get to one eighty, that'd be great. Then I could buy two power cells. Oh, I see what I did. So now I can jump up here. I think one more right there I, if I remember correctly getting seven gives you a power cell right hey what's up Queen Bee how's it going it did there we go here all right so I guess I'll go back to the front now because there's no way for me to get to that power up point at the moment. I don't think. Got a headache, but otherwise good. Okay, well. So not perfect, but not terrible. How did I miss all these? Man, 
man. Okay, we're almost back to the village. Have you ever played the Jack and Daxter games, Bell? I played this one back when it came out, like 20 years ago. I don't think I ever finished it though. I know I played all of this section, but it's all so fuzzy. You know, that's so long ago. We're doing really good, Bell. No complaints, really. Preston's got a bit of a cough, but he's okay otherwise. Okay. I guess I'll buy this one first. Oh, hey, dudes! Did you find my muse yet? Oh, wait. No, he wanted me to go to that island, I forgot. I'm as inspired as. Right here, there we go. Okay, let's go buy a power cell from somebody else who yeah, right here. So, uh, you uh, want to make a contribution? Good. A, a sizable one, I hope. You! <laughs> oh, it is a sizable contribution. I, well, 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 I, I, I just hope this power cell adequately represents my gratitude. No problem, buddy. All right, so I need 33 more to get the next power cell. So I guess we'll go this way. I don't think I've been this way yet. Good night, Janet. Thank you for hanging out. I appreciate it. Oh man. <laughs> really digging the music. Oh man. The double jump, you gotta hit it like you can't wait too long. You can't delay it forever like you can in some other platforms. You gotta kinda do it quickly. Hell yeah. Oh, punch the yaks into the pen? Okay. Is this the pin over here? Okay, let me make sure. I should probably talk to him first to make sure I trigger it. Gotta milk those yak cows. Oh, it's you. Oh, just resting my tired bones. I've been trying to get those unreal yak cows back into the pen all day. Some strange creatures tried to steal them earlier. I got you, my guy. Help an old man and try to get them back into the corral. I got you. Get up! No, wrong way. Get along, little doggy. Come on. Almost there. Come on. Okay, does that count? Is this considered in the pen now? 
It actually reminds me of corralling the like the cows and stuff at the beginning of Twilight Princess in Zelda. Except you're on horseback in that one. No, no! Here we go, there we go. Alright, alright. Alright, and a little smack on the butt for you. Don't get the wrong idea. We're just friends, okay? And I think, is this the last one? Oh, there's two more, okay. Let's try to double up, I'll do two at the same time. I'm very talented, as you can see. Really? Come on. There we go. Come on. Come on. Nope, wrong way. And there we go. No, hey! What are you doing? That lazy farmer owes us a power cell. <laughs> Let's go there talk go. to him. Yeah, I'm gonna bring him across from the jewel bag. Oh, well done, my boy. You actually got those flea bags back into the pen. Now I can sleep in peace. Take this power cell for your trouble. Thank you, thank you kindly. Appreciate it. Yeehaw! Good trophy name. Let's grab some more orb eggs. See, the game calls these orbs, but they're clearly eggs, right? Like. I need nine more. You don't have enough power cells to fuel my heat shield. Aww. You can't cross Fire Canyon until you collect enough power cells. All right, see ya, Janet. Thank you. I usually stream on Sunday and Tuesday as well, but Thursday's retro. I'm gonna. I'm committed to finishing this game, so I'll play it on every Thursday till I'm done. I'm really enjoying it. It's aged pretty well. No, nope, nothing over there. The Forbidden Jungle. Not looking very jungly. More like a beach. Are you kidding me? First waterfall I found in this game. There's nothing behind it. I feel ripped off right now. The jungle part? Yeah, here we go. Okay. I was gonna say it wasn't feeling very jungly, but this is better. Oh man, these bridges, this is giving me flashbacks to Crash Bandicoot. I don't like that. I thought that snake was a lot closer than it was. My depth perception must be way off. Oh, 
Oh man. Oh, save with some water. Freaking piranhas, man. around this way all right where else should I go here well whatever this is I can't do anything with it yet Out of the water. I hear. Am I just hearing this pad thing? Okay, I need to go that way. I see a lot of orbs over there. Here we go. I don't know how to kill that thing. I gotta be careful, I've only got one hit left. Okay, this is the fisherman guy. Monsters patrolling the ocean took a bite out of me fishing rig, and now they're gobbling up me catch. No matter what I try, I can't seem to catch a single fish in this river. Woo! Maybe it's your breath. You think you can do better? Try <laughs> scooping up river fish with a tiny net. I'll give you a power cell if you can catch 200 pounds of them critters. And then I'll let you and Trip pounds? here use my speedboat to get to Misty Island. He's wanting oh. to try the challenge. Yeah, there are two it. types of good fish to catch. One pound fishies and five pound fishies. <laughs> if you miss 20 pounds of good fish, then I'm gonna take me net back from you. Oh, there are okay. poisonous eels in this river. Catch even a one of them boogers and you'll poison the whole darn catch. Okay. Steady boy. Man, I love I love little mini games. Stay boy. Nice, doing okay. Gotta dodge all the poisonous eels. Don't miss crap. like that again. Man. Here comes a big one. Steady boy. Ooh. Ooh. I am not going to make it. Oh my god. This is so intense. First try, first try. What do you mean I'm missing them all? 
Here's the power I crushed it. Promised. And you can use my boat at the village dock whenever you like. I don't need your judgment. <laughs> well, the glowing ones you're supposed to miss. He said those are poisonous to not catch them. If, if I had caught even one of those, it would have reset me back to the beginning, it said. Hey, what's up, Baron? Okay, so I don't want to go that way. So I guess we go back up here. And I need some health is what I need. Oh my god. So close to getting another health point. Whoops. How is work tonight, Aaron? How are you doing? Oh man. Man. Well, now I know. Oh, okay, it was just one. Okay, let's go look over here. Come on, turn the camera. There we go. I would like to jump down there, but I don't want I don't want to get hurt. Oh wait, I see. There's a path right over there. Perfect. There we go. Bad night. Whoa, that's a lot of waste, man. What happened? Did something happen? <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, wait a second. Okay, okay. I get to keep all my orbs. So I didn't lose any orb progress. It just puts me back at the checkpoint physically, but I still get to keep all my stuff. supposed to do against that giant tentacle. Maybe I just can't fight him yet. Gonna turn. Nope, nope. That's a cool screenshot right there. Let's 
put the tentacle out of the frame. There we go. I like it. I like it. That's a good screenshot. Alrighty. Um, how am I supposed to get all the way up there? What the heck? Was I supposed to do a ground pound? That's gonna bother me now. You had to rerun three press runs. Wow. That's nuts. Did anyone get fired for that kind of stuff? Well, at least it's not something you're getting in trouble for. Yeah, no problem, Bell. Thank you for hanging out. Oh, you're the one that caught them? Okay, well, I think a reward of some kind is in order. should mean I can access the supercharge thing a little bit better more easily now yeah what's in here oh hell yeah I 
immediately jump down. <laughs> I just completely overshot it. At least there's no penalty. Did I already do all this? Yes, I did. So that's a waste of time. That looks like a Zelda boss. Does it not have a name? Oh, really? Me, homie. This is a lot like his all the boss. Oh man. Alright, three hits. There we go. Hell yeah. Jack and Daxter's really fun, Aaron. It has aged very well. This is the PS4 version. You can download it for it's in the PlayStation Store. Can I just keep how many? Oh, okay. All three of them are on PSN. That's how you get those, okay. I was wondering. Even though the viewer turnout has not been very spectacular so far, I do think I'm going to finish this game. So for the next few Thursdays, this is what I'll be playing. Okay, wait, I wanted to actually go down there. I figured this would be a good game to uh, to mix things up a little bit, since the other game I'm playing is Last of Us 2. And it's consistent because it's also Naughty Dog, same developer. What a major, major difference between this and what Naughty Dog does nowadays. I don't know, doing retro on Twitch is a little more difficult in some ways than it was on Facebook. That was That's the one thing that was actually a lot easier to do on Facebook is Retro Nights because there's a ton of groups that you can share the stream into for people to tune in 
Raz on Twitch. Let's get up on that machine and break the mirror it's a very different community. It just takes a lot longer to establish your channel in different, you know, scenes and types of games. I think as as the Twitch grows slowly over time, um, stuff like Retro Night will probably find a bigger audience. At the end of the day, I do this for fun. So even if there's not a lot of people watching, I'm still going to keep doing retro because I like playing retro games. Especially when I get to go back and play games like this that I never finished as a kid. Finally, I ever got to, you know, just play this one a little bit. I think I rented it once or a friend had it or something like that. I don't know. Is there a way? Oh, okay. I'm missing two still. I see. Okay. <laughs> Guaranteed one viewer. That's right, man. I actually started a lot earlier tonight than usual. I've already been live for an hour and 20 minutes. And so I actually I had a, a chunk of people watching earlier. People from Twitter and stuff, you know, that are asleep now, but people that stop by in the beginning to hang out. And then once 11.30 rolls around, my time, I know that's, uh, that's Aaron time. All reliable over here. Okay, I don't know where that boat's at. There's that guy that said I could use his boat. Okay, I already heard it all those. Where's the dock? Oh, it's right there. Okay, so I can go back to the Misty Island. I'll do that after I buy these other two power orbs. I see you two are back to make the trade. Good, good, jolly good. Hey, you have the uh, precursor orbs that we agreed on? I hope you put this hard-earned power cell to good use. Cheerio, ta-ta, bye-bye. Cheerio, old chap. I only need three more before I can venture into the northern island. Or whatever it's called. Um, wasn't there someone else? That I could pay. I could have sworn. Okay, now I already, already traded this guy. Maybe not. I must be. Am I losing my mind here? To the mayor, to your uncle. Wasn't there a, an old lady? There's no map, so. I'm trying to just remember with my old brain here. Okay, he wants me to go to the Northern Island, or the Misty Island, to find his, like, gecko or whatever the hell it was. Is it this guy? No, I've already, I've already done this one. I've already traded with him, haven't I? Back already? And without fixing the eco beams? 
<laughs> yeah, okay. Your village needs you, boys! Okay. Oh no, the old lady, I got the egg for her. Okay, so I already did that one. Um, let's see, what's over here? This is all the birds. Yeah, okay. I've already did that. I feel like there was someone else I was supposed to talk to before I get on this boat. Maybe I should go talk to my uncle? What you working on? Be careful with that. Oh, I'm trying to figure out how to transport the Zoomer using the trans pads the precursors left all over the world. If you come across one of these pads, I can lock onto your communicator's location and send you the Zoomer. Keep an eye out for a trans pad when you explore Misty Island and wherever else you go. So the storyline is um, there are these people called the precursors that have this magical energy source on this world and no one really understands it or how it works or where it came from but you're apparently the chosen one or whatever and you have the ability to interact with stuff that no one else can so it's up to you to find out what's going on and there, there is a wise man, a sage or whatever, stationed at the northern end of this island. But the only way to get there is to go across a like a lava area. And in order to go there, I need to power up the ship in its heat shield with 20 power orbs, power cells. I've got 17, so I've almost got enough. Oops. <sighs> yeah, there's like there's like five or six of these games. There's three on the PS2. There's a a racing game. Jack X Combat Racing. There was a PSP one, Jack and Daxter, like New Frontier or something like that. And then Dexter had a solo spinoff on PSP. Oh, this place gives me the creeps. And trust me, it's a whole new experience when you're covered in fuzz. I've never really played any of them, to be honest. I mean, I played this one a little bit. I think right around here is where I stopped. Back in the day, you know, on PS2. I don't think I ever got very far. Okay, got a double tap. Okay, so I gotta get powered up and jump on that thingy. Cause I don't think we'll make it back. Really? <laughs> well, that'll do it. Okay, start back at the beginning here. Yeah, they it's the trilogy itself is a connected story. So Jack and Daxter, the Precursor Legacy, that's this one. And then you've got Jack 2 and Jack 3, is what they called them. They're all directly connected. It's a trilogy. All the other games are... I mean, they're connected. The story is connected, but... They're, you know, kind of spin-offs and stuff like that. 
but the main trilogy was on the PS2. That's kind of... <clears throat> Naughty Dog's whole thing. They got the Crash Bandicoot trilogy on PS1, they did the Jack and Daxter trilogy on PS2, PS3 had the Uncharted trilogy, and then they obviously did um, Uncharted 4 and Lost Legacy on PS4. And then Last of Us 1 and 2. Oh man, oh my god, really? Damn. Hey! I see the sculptor's news! Oh, it's right there. Really? This guy's gonna make me chase him. How do I jump that far? Yeah, Naughty Dog does still have a third Last of Us, don't they? I think, officially speaking, They've said that they... I don't think that's in development at the moment. I think it's still too early. But I mean, they must be working on something, right? Last of Us 2 came out a year ago. I can't wait to see what they do with PS5. Okay, I gotta see where to, where's the most efficient... Mark over those bones. didn't work. Oh, wait. It did put me over here, even though I didn't make the jump. That's awesome. Watch your back! We remember what happened the last time we were here! Oh, God. It's this an like ambush, a, It's Jack. a combat arena. It's an ambush! Ready, go makes your attack stronger! all these greens real quick. Two more before I can officially do the thingy. Where am I supposed to go? How do I get down? Do I just jump off? Nope. That was a bad idea. Okay, well that worked. 
Yeah, he's like a weasel or a rat or something. At the very beginning of the game, um, he falls into like this dark e echo energy pool, and that's what transforms him. Before he was just a he was a person, so this isn't his natural form. See here. Is there a way to get? Yeah. I think that would be enough to give me. Okay, I think I know what I can do. Baby, go. There we go. Nice. Nineteen. Just need to grab one more. How many are over here? Oh, my God. There's a lot. I gotta remember I can spin to prolong my jumps too. Get over here. This dude is so annoying. Really? 
You're just doing a circle? How am I supposed to catch this guy? This is dumb. go oh he runs backwards I don't know how I'm supposed to catch this thing Apparently I need to find like a teleporter pad of some kind somewhere. And thank you very much, Aaron. I appreciate it. Turning that guy in is going to give me a power cell, but here's another one I think. Yeah. supposed to do? I guess so. Said, oh, okay. Tread the lurkers, Jack. Not the but, you, mines! but you can't hit the balloons. Always. This is an interesting little mini game. Ooh, that's some sick air. Okay, hold up. Is that a power cell floating in the air? I gotta get up on top of this one. Oh, I see. Okay. Man, I have to get all the eggs. They're right there in front of me like that. I can't leave it. There we go. It's gonna be hard to get that power cell. I gotta do it though. Oh my god. Really? I was so close. Okay, the trick is turning before you need to. 
Yeah, because you got you have to have enough speed to get that one. That's the tricky part. Get it eventually. I'm sorry, but I had to keep trying this until I get it. Ah, uh -huh, dang it. If I can do it without hitting the wall, I think that's enough speed. I guess you have to go on foot somehow. Yeah. <coughs> really? That was dumb. I'll say something really teary at the funeral. Like, how am I gonna get Shane back now? <laughs> Are you kidding me? little jumping puzzle action going on here. Okay, I, I like it, I like it. I'll come back to that here in just a second. Let's go grab these egg orbs over here real quick first. Are you, what? Are you kidding? I definitely stomped that guy. Thank you for the thumbs up, Aaron. Much appreciated. I gotta find some blue ether stuff. Yeah, I see it. Okay. I can see how this is going to work. That is not anywhere near enough to get that far, though. See some more blue ether over here. Alright, so that opened the door. Is this another arena? 
Alright. Oh no, it's just... Oh, it's the other entrance to the same room. Okay. Yeah. That's not enough. I don't know. Oh, it's almost enough. I might be able to get there. Okay, let me try that again. If I go across the bridge, I think I might be able to do it. Yes! Those dark eco boxes are Say goodnight, Jack! <laughs> oh, it still works, okay. Hell yeah, there we go. Alright, I'm ready to head back. There's still two and a half left to get on this island, but whatever. I don't care. Oh wait, there's a jumping puzzle one. I'll go do that one at least. We can get past all those logs. I'm guessing there's a power cell up here. Crash Bandicoot vibes going here. That went pretty well, all things considered. Anything else over here? No. What about over here? No. Ouch. Nice. Charging it up. My bad. There we go. Okay. Okay, can I just jump back down there? Nice! Alright, so there's no fall damage. I guess it makes sense when you can ground pound. Nice. Alright, I'm ready to go back to the village now. Alright. Let's 
let's make some progress. Let's go across the volcano lava canyon or whatever it's called. So you want to know something surprising, Aaron? I'm hearing pretty good things about the new Madden, apparently. People are saying that it's better than last year's. Good. You've collected enough power cells to fuel my heat shield. Meet me by the entrance to the fire canyon by climbing the cliff behind the farmer's house. Bring the power cells and hurry. My father says he's seen more lurkers around. I'll definitely be waiting for reviews, but it's encouraging that people are saying it's pretty good this year. Apparently they made a lot of upgrades to the uh, franchise mode, which is exciting, because that was my, my main gripe with it. Yeah, Madden 22. My franchise is supposed to be better, apparently. Well, uh, better you than me. Honestly, it's. I think it's a little annoying that you can still take damage whenever you're in the supercharged mode. I always forget, if you blow up everything you touch, so I just assumed that would extend the combat as well, but apparently not. If the reviews are good, I'll get it. I'll be getting it on Xbox if I do. I think it'd be fun to stream Madden, especially like the career mode, you know? Maybe not franchise mode, but like the actual career mode. I think that would be fun to stream. Have I completely lost my mind? Is it the lava area over here? I think this is where I'm supposed to go. Right? Or am I completely lost? I don't know. can jump? <clears throat> Alright, so I already did all this. Man. Okay. I don't know where the entrance to the fireplace is. I'm all turned around because there's no map at all. It must be back over here somewhere. Hurry up with those power cells. I'm waiting at the head of Fire Canyon, at the top of the cliff behind the farmer's house. Behind the farmer's house. That is not as descriptive as you would think. Is it here? Is this the farmer? Oh, it is. Okay. There we go. Okay, let's go ahead and save real quick.
Already at 22% apparently. That's surprising. Great! You have the 20 cells needed to power my heat shield. Now be careful. The shield will only protect your zoomer till it reaches 500 degrees. So try to keep her cool. Flying over open lava will definitely heat you up fast. Hit 500 degrees and it's over. Over? Like burning molten metal over? The fire canyon gets pretty hot. So keep a lookout for jumps to keep you off the hot ground. I've also oh. released several blue cooling balloons you can use to drop the shield's temperature quickly. Okay. Oh, and when you get across, don't forget to activate the teleport gate in the Blue Sage's lab. Then we'll be able to teleport over and meet you. Good luck! Let's do it. Hit those balloons to cool off! Man. Not going well. Oh, I missed the balloon. Use the All right, let's try that again. That is not easy. So avoid the yellow boxes. Oh. So landing on enemies will give you some air time. Good to know. Oh, that makes you go faster. Definitely plenty of stuff I miss, but that's fine. Thank you, Aaron. Appreciate it. Rock Village. How do I activate the teleport? This doesn't look good. Does not look good at all. I thought I just tried that. There's a button. Down up, Destiny. What's up? I don't think I'll ever get used to that teleport. This game really does hold up. Hey, it's so good still. That looks like the blue sage through a party. I'm having oh, a lot of fun. Rock Village is on fire. One heck of a party. No, no, I mean Rock Village is being bombarded with flaming boulders. Oh, and it looks like the Blue Sage is working on a levitation machine to move them. Assuming it's operational, we're going to need power cells to fuel it. I guess you two are going to have to find some more. This is the we first time I've played it notes. since around the time back. it came out, so Go it's been a while. The and come back and give us an update. And take the furball with you. It was included with Lost Legacy? I never knew that. What could have happened to him? I love Lost Legacy. That game is so good.
It says I'm 23% done, which is a little surprising. Yeah, I loved, I loved Lost Legacy. I think it's number three for me. I think my favorite's Uncharted 4, then Until 2, find out why the blue then Lost Legacy. You're going to need to collect 45 power cells to fuel his machine. Go get him. But it's definitely close. It's a toss-up. Nasty lurkers. You two look like a couple of capable fellows. I've got a research project going, and maybe you could help me out. Hey, we're the ones on a big quest here. We ask you for help. Well, perhaps we can help each other. I've been studying the burrowing habits of lightning moles in the Precursor Basin next to our village for years. But now those awful lurkers have scared the moles to the surface. And since they're blind as bats, they can't find their way back underground. Mm. If you could herd them back into their burrowing tunnels, you might just save their lives. More herding. I've got a power cell that says you can do it. Yeah, lightning moles. We care. Maybe for two power cells. Nice try. But I would be willing to part with another power cell if you two find me 90 precursor orbs for my research equipment. It's a very different Fair kind enough. of game from what I remember. Isn't Jack 2 kind of more like oh, you have Ratchet and Clank? It's a lot of Here's guns. A power cell we agreed upon. And then Jack 3 was like a open world adventure game with a bunch of different vehicles and stuff. A lot of people love Jack 2. I never really played it. I think a friend of mine rented it and I played it a little bit. But I am loving this one so far. What is this? Oh, is this when I'm this is the hurting thing? I've said it before, I'll say it again. Avoid the dark ego boxes. Yeah, GTA inspired is a good way to put it. Very edgy, right? From what I remember. I don't even know what I'm supposed to do with this thing. Am I supposed to hit it? You can't do any attacks when you're on this. So let me make sure I get all my egg orbs. Don't want to miss any of these. Oh. No, you can't shoot. Oh, but you can jump. Oh no, that just makes you go down. So it's not a jump, you just go downward. Is this making me go faster? Man. Oh, I'm not a completionist at all, so I'm not even worried about getting a platinum. <clears throat> 
Oh, that's too bad that Ian had such terrible taste in burgers. Yeah, is there a boost? Okay, nope, that was that was a bad idea. To be honest, I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing. Am I... Does that herd the moles into their holes? Okay. So that's the red ones. So that's the hole. Okay, here. Let's see if I can man. It's a little hard to herd them, but they're not going to run in the direction I want. Go, 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 go. There we go. Herding the yaks back into their pen was a lot easier. Because you weren't on a bike. You just ran up and punched them and they went in. This, like, hover bike thing is super floaty. Not the ideal way to herd something. There we go. How many more are there? Ah. Okay. Turn around. No! Damn it. There we go. Perfect. Go, 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 go. What? How are you gonna swerve right at the last second? Okay, so that's the last one there. I want to hit one of these things. I want to know what it does. Oh, wait. Man. Okay, I have to get those eggs now. It's going to drive me crazy if I don't grab those. I need to talk to you about your car's extended warranty. Where are you going? There we go. Did that do anything? What was the point of that? Alright. I am extremely over that. This lady is lucky that I did when I herded all your weasels or whatever the hell they were. Thank you for saving those moles. That's awfully good of you. Here's a power cell to help you out. Now I can get back to my research. Power lunch. I've got 25 power cells. this stuff. Oh, this is a little thingamajig. It's probably got a decent number of Orbeez in there. Okay. Alright. Is this enough? Can I get there? Go, baby, go. Go, baby, go. Aw, man. What did you just click? Beware of the dark light, for it has twisted the fate of one of you. Bring me 120 precursor orbs. Oh, for I've each got you covered. I contain. I've got you covered. Here is another power cell for your quest. I wonder how many this guy has. Oh, the car extended warranty. All right. Well, thank you. That was a good idea for a clip. Okay, I'm gonna save the 197 I've got because I might need them for to exchange for it somewhere else. Oh, my aching head! I thought that's one of your 
those vital organs. Walk it off, tough guy. Oh, oh sure, I was tough wrecked. once. Maybe oh, even no. the toughest of them all. I single-handedly defended this village from those horrid creatures for almost a year. Then that horrible monster arrived and commenced the Boulder Bombardment. So, full of valor, armor shining in the sun, I climbed the hill to take him on. But he pounded me like one tenderizes a yakow steak. I bet you he did. attacking him with your melodrama? Cause a it's word choice me. there, my guy. After my last stunning failure, he got pounded. He sealed the passageway to his roost with a 30 ton boulder, leaving no way for anyone to challenge him again. So, our sage, a master of blue eco and a mechanical genius, devised a machine capable of lifting the boulder out of the way. But alas, he disappeared before we had a chance to turn it on. And he took all of his power cells with him. How many do you need? At least I was able to pull enough pontoons out of our bridge to prevent that monster from coming down here to do me harm. Yeah, good, good job, tough guy. But uh, we're gonna need you to uh, put him back and stuff. Oh, sure. And seal my doom? <sighs> all right. Fine. Bring me 90 precursor orbs and I'll let the pontoons loose. But I'm not going to fight that monster again. <laughs> <clears throat> Wonderful. You brought me the precursor orbs. All right. I'll fix the bridge. But don't ask me to get involved with that creature again. Doesn't sound too excited. Noise, noise. <laughs> hey, what about you? Oh, no, not another hero. I lost my shorts on this so-called hero's big fight against the monster up there. Yeah, I bet. Trust me, the smart money's on the monster. That way you pretty much tapped me out. So, I got a proposal. Bring me 90 orbs to get me back on my feet and out of this barrel, and I'll give you a power cell in return. And if you're game, I do have one more bet on mine. My big comeback. Beat the record time racing Dead Man's Gorge in the Precursor Basin, and I'll get a pretty payoff. But that... I'll give you another power cell. <laughs> oh, yeah! These drops to help me win my way back out of this barrel. Here's the power cell I I'm promised. guessing he doesn't have any clothes. He's a gambler. Maybe he lost his clothes in a bet or something. That seems to be what the insinuation is. more robot bug thingies. You're good. You're good. Leave me alone. Just one more robot bug fly. Oh, that's a different region. Okay, that doesn't count. Let's go back over here. The rock village is where we're at. Nope. Oh, there's only two left here. The Oracle and the Scout Flies. Oh my god. Jesus. Oh. 
Oh, okay. Well, that was basically a shortcut then. That's actually what I wanted. How do we get to those other ones over there? Oh, there's the last scout fly too. Okay, hang on. Hold up, hold up, hold up, everybody. Everybody shut up a minute. Here we go, I found it. Quite the detective. Ding, ding, ding. Cursor City. I do not think I can jump that far. Oh, okay. Down to Atlantis. Nope, that was a mistake. Anyway, I just really like this elevator ride. It's my favorite part of this entire game, to be honest. So I'm just going to keep triggering it over and over and over. This is cool. Man. Oh my god. Did I not complete it? Yeah, I like the music a lot. It's quite good. Objective here. Oh, 
it's for this thing. Okay. It's reset. I understand what I'm supposed to do now. I understand. It all makes sense. Very long way. What I actually need to do. Doesn't matter, that's fine. Whatever. So, I need to hit this, grab the blue ether, and then trigger that button thing up there. Hydration reminder, thank you. I'm about to stop streaming anyway, so you're not going to miss much. Oh, this is a whole zone. I didn't realize this was an entire region into itself. Alright, I actually think I'm at a pretty good stopping point right now. Made quite a bit of progress. It says I'm at 30% completion already, which is pretty cool. Yeah, so thank you everybody for tuning in. Hope you had a good time watching.